As the ward fills up, the medical officer in company with the sister begins his round. Each patient is carefully examined to see if any intermediate treatment is necessary before evacuation. The envelope issued by the medical unit shows the man's rank, name and number and a diagnosis of his injuries at a glance. Inside the envelope, this form number 3118 gives similar information and the identity of the medical unit to which he was admitted as a casualty. Spaces on the inside are for notes on general condition and treatment. The penicillin label, being bright yellow, is easily recognized. Spaces filled in show the dose of drug and the date and time it was given. Where the standard time or dose has been varied by the medical officer who began the treatment, he gives special instructions on this card. This one gives similar information about the sulfur drug. Its distinctive marks may vary, but this one is typical. The casualty air evacuation label AFW3083 is issued in triplicate. On this is entered the identification number of the aircraft in which he is to travel and also the name of the airfield of employment. In this case, the patient has a serious wound in the thigh, but so far no complications have developed. Sometimes X-ray negatives accompany a patient. Air orderlies must take great care of them and stow them with the patient to avoid loss or misplacement. The examination completed, our patient is declared fit for evacuation and his name is entered on the list by the sister. <laughs>